Hi, my name is Lloyd from electricsense.com and today I'm going to uh, do a little demonstration for you. I'm going to be uh, explaining about uh, the dangers of Wi-Fi routers. Uh, so I've got here, uh, I've got my microphone so you can hear me nice and clear I hope. Bring it a little bit closer. So I've got my microphone, I've got the Wi-Fi router in question for the demonstration and I've got my um, radio frequency meter here which is going to give us some measurements. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch on this meter which is going to show us what the Wi-Fi router is doing uh, when it's switched on and then I'm going to switch off the meter so that you can see the difference between the radio frequency pollution when it's switched on and when it's switched off. Okay, so here we go. So switch it on to start with, and you can hear on the audio we've got like a tick 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 that noise which you can hear very clearly. Put it right next to the microphone. You can actually hear and you can see here with these lights. We've got peak readings in voltmeters and uh, average readings here. You can actually see that we are picking up some uh, electromagnetic uh, pollution. Yeah. So, uh, and even if I bring it away quite a long way in fact it's still the readings are still about the same it's quite powerful this okay so and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch this off so try and do that there we go so I switched it off and there you can hear virtual silence and you can see we have still got some readings because we're in an environment where there is electric smog present not just from this but uh, but you can see that that is a major contributor in this house to uh, electromagnetic pollution. So I'll switch this off now. This is just a standard router uh, which is being equipped in more and more homes uh, because it gives uh, us telephone, uh, internet and uh, television. And uh, you can appreciate that uh, when that is in your home it's throwing out electromagnetic pollution 24 hours a day seven days a week to you and everybody else uh, in your family and even to your neighbors and that your neighbors uh, Wi-Fi router is doing the same thing uh, to you so it's all adding uh, to the electro smog I don't have one of these things I've got a standard I've got a uh, an older version um, router which works on a cable now this one will work on a cable but uh, this one is an orange version here um, but the problem with this particular model is you, the only way you can switch these off is by doing what I just did and that is disconnecting the power on the wall you cannot actually, there is actually a setting uh, so that you can manually um, kill the Wi-Fi and use it on a cable. There is a setting but the problem is with this model and many models is they've got an automatic uh, an automatic upgrade on them and they do automatic downloads all the time all day long and if you switch it off then as soon as it gets an upgrade it switches it back on again so you can't actually switch them off. I know with this one that's the case because I've, I've, uh, I've tried it. So my advice to you if you have one of these is initially uh, is to switch it off at night so that will reduce already significantly uh, and uh, the, the, the pollution that you're getting and also it will give you um, uh, less pollution at the most important time which is when you sleep and the second thing is I would say as soon as you can is to replace this unit with a unit which you can actually you sure you can switch off uh, the Wi-Fi function on it my name is Lloyd at Electric Sense dot com thank you for listening have a good day